Pretty hard. My twat. <laughs> it's just not nice. Right. I'll be both having this. I don't know what's going on. Oh. Hi, and welcome back to Finders, Beepers, History Seekers. This week, we are in a cottage, which I, I say it like it's somewhat different every week at the moment. It seems to be cottages all it's the time. It's a house. Yeah, is it? It's a house. What what defines a cottage or a house? What is the difference? Um, when you go in to meet men, and the other one you just go in no, and sleep. No, you can't say that. <laughs> well, no, but really, honestly, what is the difference between a house and a cottage? I don't know. Is it just a size? Can a house be small? Can a small house small or a big, big house? house? Age? I suppose you can't have a big cottage. I don't know. Well, Answers on a postcard and, and let us know. But yeah, we thought you were wrapping them. Brap, brap, brap. <laughs> yeah, we, we're in this house slash cottage. Flash. It's not a bungalow, it's gone upstairs. Anyway, shut up. We're going to have a look. And also, I have to address it again. Yes, I do say horrible to things to Andy. Horrible to things. <laughs> <laughs> I say. Can you speak? <laughs> I say horrible things to Andrew. I don't mean any of them. I love him very much. He's lovely. He never does anything wrong. I like him a lot. He is beautiful. Anyway, let's, let's get out of here and see what we can find. Oh, yeah. And you can go first. Can I? Yeah. Don't look at me. Don't that torch anyway. What do you mean? We don't. Why? Because you've got the whitest teeth, you'd be able to blow uh, right. the whole house what up. What is this obsession with my teeth all of a sudden? People keep talking about my teeth. Somebody said that I've got false teeth. Nah. Look, I've got I've got half of a machine. At least you have got nice teeth. Unlike mine, like I said, the belonging to which doctor's necklace, but reminds me of a llama. You like a llama. I ain't got two big front ones. Llamas are got... they like <laughs> Oh you tramp. Anyway, spit it, you don't the llamas. Let's get let's get out of here, come on. Right. You know what? We've been to a lot of places that are like this. Have they got a cooker? Oh, yeah, they have got a cooker and a hob. Oh, just thinking that, because I saw yeah. that there. Why do they have that as well? Is that maybe to boil the kettle while they're cooking the tea? Well, that's those power cuts. But then they've gas. got a kettle there. So they've got a... What do you mean, power cuts? We're not in, like, North Africa or something. We've got no power. Well, I hope they are, because that's where we're going. Of course they've got power. Why would they not have power? But, yeah... I don't get it. I don't get why there's one of those there and then a normal hobby type thing there, unless the hob stopped working. Yeah. I suppose that could be it. Size that extractor can extract me out of that. <laughs> That's massive. Oh, look, look at these old school photos. That is a big ivy covered school, isn't it? That's a lot newer, that. That's got to be like. 90s or early 2000s or something, isn't it? That now that's just like a jizz mark on it, it's not writing. <laughs> You've just been wiping it off, yeah. <laughs> <just> wrong, you, <laughs> but yeah, that's look. What era would you say this is? 60s, 70s. I said 70s, maybe air cuts, not lads. Yeah, wow, looking at the women, the woman, woman, the woman, woman. Look at her hair there, look. Oh God, that woman, woman. She looks like the queen. 60s, 70s. Yeah, definitely. <laughs> what is going on? Why are you copying me? What have we got in here? Tat. Look at that. Timmy. You need to take that for next place we go to with rats. Well, it's not having a flamethrower for rats. <laughs> you can't flamethrow rats. I'm gonna get some matches and some Aerosol. Yeah. You know what? I once threw a can of uh, links on a fire. It blew up and almost took my mate's head off. It stuck into a tree next to his head. Did it? Yeah. I also put some um, 12 gauge rifle cartridges on the same fire. That didn't go down well either. No, but it didn't. So. Just get tinned again. Yeah. Why do people collect them? I suppose it's to put stuff. God, there's enough pottery and stuff in here, isn't there? Soda siphon. Not a cider siphon. Cider siphon. Yeah, there's loads in there. Right, we'll have a bit of a look through some of the things, see if we can find anything. Right, we've just stopped a minute because of 
there's just been two big bangs, haven't there? Yeah. And it's, I thought it was the way that we've got in. So we rushed back there. There was nothing the first time and then we just heard it again. And we're just absolutely petrified that in a minute, there's gonna be a face appears at one of these windows. I pull my pants. Pretty, I'm off. <laughs> yeah. I, I, I ain't counting you, I'm off. I like oh, no. I know what you mean, but then it, if it's a, depends what sort of face it is. If it's got no face. Well, if it's got no face, you won't fucking see it. Yeah, it'd be scary. What? Unless you're looking, unless looking at me like that. Well, yeah, exactly. Or if it's just an empty hood. It'd be the grudge, bitch. <laughs> God, here we go again about the grudge. I've never seen the grudge, so I don't even really know what you mean. The grudge, bitch, or the ring, bitch. Which one comes out at telly? Grudge, I think. The ring, bitch, comes out at well. Oh. Was that poltergeist? What comes out at what? telly? I don't know, I ain't seen Poltergeist. <sighs> I've seen Thingy Paranormal. Paranormal Activity? That's the one. Well, That's the that one. one. Yeah, I've seen that one. Right. Is that this one, are you? I know, I don't know what it is. Because if it's not people, then it's something weird. And if it's not animal. Well, yeah. There's no fucking horse coming through the door down there or something like that. Esther Ranton's walking in. <laughs> right. Now, there's all these little bits on here. Most of them are just... They're very, oh, you're here, Andy. Not even noticed. It is. Look. <laughs> oh, my like God. Beard. But, yeah. Oh, you look. Oh, you must really like Stop it. I can't help it. If I hear it, I hear it. Well, yeah, it is very, very similar to you. Oh, look, he's into his models by the looks of things. Model building. What is after Pretoria? Guerrilla War. When's that from? Was, what's now called Pretoria? Is that South Africa, Pretoria? Yeah, Pretoria, South Africa. Yeah. It's still Pretoria, isn't it? Yeah. I think so. Supplement to, with the flag to Pretoria. Where's it from? I swear I don't like this. It's little fucking noises. Yeah, isn't it like the Boer War? Guerrilla War, it says. Oh, it says there, look. Oh, 1900, July 27th to 29th, 1900. Went the Boer War like 1896 or something like that. It's got to be 1800s. Look at uniforms. Oh, look at him. What a guy. Well, that looks like bloody America. <laughs> oh, look. Oh, no, 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 look. Boa sharpshooters sighting a British patrol. So it is the, must be the Boer War. That's South Africa, isn't it? Boer War. Oh, look, look. Look at these guys. Look, look. Look at him, Lord Roberts and Sir Alfred with their personal staff. Please stop fucking looking off over behind me because there is. But yeah, that book's really good. I'd like to have a proper look through I'm that. I'm carrying this. <laughs> Whack them round head when Tom, they come. Jeremy Paxman. I don't know. Oh, is he the is he like news now? Something like that, isn't he? I don't look like Jeremy Paxman. No. Anyway. Let's have a look in this next room. Yeah. Yeah, because I need to move away from this behind me. It's really putting me on edge. Oh, look at the pictures on the wall. We're straight over to them. I wonder if this oh Oh, I thought it was writing underneath. But it isn't. It's, look at them. Oh, I feel an instant connection to that man. I think he's very nice. Maybe not his pet, but him. And his and his missus is quite. She's a bit toothy, but she's uh, she's. <laughs> she's <Horse> coming. <laughs> yeah, that's what we can hear. But yeah, she's very nice. She looks very friendly. She does, doesn't she? Yeah. I feel like she might serve me a pint down the uh, Red Lion. That's what, how she's coming across. I'll give me like six bread cakes from the local baker's. Why six? I don't know. Would it not be a baker's dozen? Thirteen? Yeah. You know why you call it a baker's dozen? Because uh, they can't fucking count and that's why they're in that job. They were selling by weight. Oh, really? Yeah. But what if you make little bread cakes? They were selling by weight. So to make sure they were correct weight, they just put an extra one on. I'm confused. 
Apparently. Right, so if you get big fucking bread cakes and little fucking bread cakes, but the big bread cakes you get 13, and the other the the big ones you get 13, the little, little ones you get, get 27. 107. <laughs> Don't get it. Don't get it at all. So look on here, what we got. Oh, oh. I'm telling you, this guy is into his trains. Yeah, look. Homeby Railways. I'm not into stuff like this, to be fair, but I know there's a lot of people that do collect stuff like this, isn't there? Just move, move them out. Are they all the train lines in there? Inside it? Yeah, they are. Yeah, yeah. bits of train line. You know what? They're massively collectible things like yeah. this as well. Is that the exchange thing, look? You, so you can change yeah. the direction. That, what's that? A motorway? Mini motorways. I see. Electric scale model, yeah. So I suppose it's like scale electric before scale electric, innit? Mm -hmm. oh, little spoons. I thought it was like a mouth organ or something. Yeah. Little teeny tiny spoons. They're so small. They're only EPNS, I think. Yeah, they are. But, oh, that's good. But yeah, I reckon we'll find more of uh, his little collection. I, I, saw, so. I saw that in there and I thought straight away, I bet he does. I wonder if he's got something in the attic, like a big train line in the attic. <gasps> That'd be good, wouldn't it, if he I had? I wanted one. Did you? Did yeah. you want one when you were younger? I did. I did a full, massive one in the attic. Did you want to work in an opticians as well? Yeah. <laughs> this, this has taken over from the hats almost, the glasses. The hats have taken over from the dresses yeah. and the glasses are taking over from the hats. <laughs> What's going to be next? God knows. Oh, look at her. She's nice as well. She's still a bit weird toothy. She's not like sticky out, big teethy. Oh, they look, they say, reveding. It should be spelling glasses, to be fair. <laughs> These actually look like mine when I've got it down. These, a bit like Reggie Cray glasses. You look like, look straight at the camera. You look like, um, oh, it's something like Lockstock. There's one of the bad guys has got big glasses with big can't see you anymore goggle eyes. Not I don't craze. No, yeah, but he's like I think he's called flat top or something like that. <laughs> flat top. <laughs> yeah. Are you sure? I'm sure it's something like that. Anyway, let me get a torch out. Right. So yeah, there's more track on there. I think there's some. Oh yeah, look. Power connecting clip. Battery control unit. So it's got all the instructions for it. Is there any more stuff? Oh yeah, look, 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 looky, 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 look. Hornby Railways, 1984, 30th edition. Oh, little crossing as well. You could literally have your motorway, your little motorway thing, linking onto it. So yeah. it'd be like a proper setup. What's in there? What is in there? What's in that little red box? What's the box there? What's in here? What's in here? I'm interested. What is it? Oh. Oh. Yeah. Some of what we don't know nothing about. I have no idea what that is. What's in here? Oh, God. Oh, a little paintbrush and sanding thing. I wonder if you like... Painting them up as well. Yeah, because they get a proper obsession with these things, some people, don't they? Yeah. And they like make trees and oh yeah, look. That's a brush too. That was a pound. What? A brush well, too. Electric, isn't it? it can't be. What's a brush too? A brush two and a brush four diesel train. You are as sad as people that do this. You literally should have had something like this as a child. I should have. <laughs> you would have loved it. I actually went train spotting down to Bristol Temple Music School. That's how I'm out. You as bad as Rachel. Rachel used to go to the airport to watch planes. You're as bad as each other. We make for each other, me and Rachel. You are, you stay away from my Rachel, I'll tell you now. I reckon we'll find some more of this stuff knocking about as we're going round. Oh. There's loads of track under there. Look at that. Is there? Yeah. That's like a little thing with wheels. Oh, it's for. Oh, a little cabbage. Yeah. But we haven't actually seen a train yet, have we? No. Just the track and stuff. Which will be disappointed. It will. Yeah, no doubt someone's pinched it. Have you noticed all these bits of bags have been chewed up, by the way? Yeah. So you know what's coming next, don't you? Not me. <laughs> Shut up, bloody not. There's only I us I do walking about, there's something wrong. 
Saying that. You got I'll to take it. You're at that age. Shh. Shh. Bit of click then through there. Yeah. Yeah. Where's this tra track you're on about? Oh, yeah. It's all buried. Oh. oh, yeah, there's loads. Ah. There's loads of it as well. Shit, loads. All of under there. What's that in that box? Careful as you turn it over. It's an unmade, whatever it is. Oh, yeah. All wagon. All the bits are still in there, never made, never finished. It's a shame. It is. But, right, let's move on. I can't actually move. I quite like that piece of brown furniture as well. I think that's good. In fact, what's in that blue thing there? I can't reach it, so I'll send the squizzy in. What is it? Oh, it's got that bottom. What is it? What is that? Is it just fastened around something? I'm confused. Is it sealed? Yeah. Oh, I think it's just like a, a throw or something, isn't it? Stop. Oh, scarf. Making too much noise in that bag. Do you know, you tell me to pick stuff up and they tell me to yeah, like but you stop don't it. have to pick it up and scrunch it to death. That's the difference. Right. Unless you found something, I'm going on to the next place. Oh, look, it's the map of the potteries and all the different shops around the edge. So if you're from around here, you might remember some of these. Oh, you didn't find all them? No. All right, we'll move on then. Move on. Right, moving round to where we've been hearing these noises coming from. Now, we were dead sure it's in here somewhere, but I don't know. Oh look, little record player. He would have sat in here, wouldn't he? Probably sat in here making his models. Do you reckon there's a wardrobe thing there? Do you reckon they moved the bed in here or something? Oh, the bed's behind you, yeah. didn't see that. So he probably ended up being here, didn't he? It's a big room though, isn't it? It is a big room. Oh look, oh, is he the same guy? Just older? And that one in there because I feel an instant connection to him so I wonder if it is the same person I'm gonna have to compare him in a minute and have a look see if it is oh look as well look at that that says Metropolitan Police Recruit Training School admit one person I wonder if you get back to a passing out parade it is the pass son. passing out parade 1978 so that's good isn't it oh here we go oh find a plane yeah. Oh, that's good. Hawker Fury. Oh. oh, they're not smelling tonight. You're joking, aren't you? You can taste it, but your things. <laughs> don't come over here. I don't know what you mean. I've looked in that box. It's just two pieces of cutlery. Is it? Yeah, there's nothing in here. What? Do not come over here. I'll strike a match. <laughs> I'll just come over here not then. Not like striking a pose. Is that okay? I'll come over here instead. I'm going to walk through this. Yeah, time. that's all right. Yeah, there's nothing down there. You're going to do another one, aren't you? I don't know. I might do. Look, there's no... I told you, they're odourless. They're fine tonight. You can't even smell them. Nuclear fallout. <laughs> That's in this corner anyway. What's over here? Oh, look. This is good. Oh. <laughs> is it finally hit you? See, it weren't that bad. But yeah, uh, a little, little radio. Oh, look at the hi-fi system as well underneath there. Oh, there. Oh, God, he likes his music, doesn't he? I'm looking to look at this. Tempus Fusit. Is it time flies? Don't know. Te Tempus Fusit. Fusit. Fugit. Is it Fugit? Tempus Fugit. Fusit? Is that a G? Tempus Fugit. Yeah, I'm sure it's time flies. Could be. That's about your weight, to be fair. So I'll stick him in my dick. <laughs> <laughs> You're a silly man. What he likes his flowery twats. What, what are you on about? Oh, fa Faulty Towers. Yeah, I ain't seen Faulty Towers for a while. I just noticed this, the naked and the dead as well. <laughs> Sorry, I think that was my fault. Well, it weren't mine. Well, you could have just put it down, not properly. It's you and your... Fat you ass. everything else. Well, we'll not talk about that. What's on here? Yeah, look. The naked and the dead. 
Surely the dead naked. I suppose you get buried in a suit though, don't you? Yeah, unless you want to be buried naked. Can you be buried naked? Not yeah. with an open coffin, I wouldn't have thought. Oh, God, no. Rigor mortis. Oh, <laughs> only time I'd be stiff. <laughs> oh, God. I have that. I put, for, put it in my me, will. Me well, they have to be naked. I have to be naked. <laughs> and have some something put into your penis to make it stand on like end. the hair bob all round it with a flower on it. <laughs> oh, my God. Right, what's further down here? Well, I'm having... Going up to the Spirit in Disguise by Doctor and the Medic played at the funeral. Somebody was talking about that. I don't know what you'd written it on or said it on, but someone were on about that. I'm having Creep by uh, Radiohead. Yeah. I'm a creep, I'm a weirdo, what the hell am I doing here? It's about right for me. It is. Right, so yeah, he's looking like he was a bit of a farmer type and this was his... Oh, look, you, you like stuff like this, don't you? Well, I don't like good life. Don't no. you like good life? No. Neither do I. Um, but just looking down here, there's loads of bits that you like, isn't there? That you were on about earlier on. Like Dad's Army. I liked Dad's Army, to be fair. Yeah. They're not, there's, they're all, are they all dead now? Oh, some missing. Shame. I think majority of them are. Right? Um, Windsor Davis is. I don't um, know Windsor. Oh, it tells you who they all are. So you've got Arthur Lowe. He's dead. Yeah. Sergeant, what's that? Uh, John Le Mizurier. Le Yeah. Dead. Uh, Clive Dunn. Dead. Uh, John Laurie. Dead. Uh, all of them are dead. Arnold Riley. Uh, Ian Lavender, he's not dead, is he? That top right? Yeah. Him. The youngest one. Yeah. Is he not dead? And James Beck. I think, yeah, I think they are all dead apart from... Oh, it's, it's, it's not what I was thinking of. When yeah. I said, it's what I call it, a little fat man, I was thinking it turns out I fought mum. Windsor Davis. Who's Windsor Davis? I don't know who Windsor Davis is. It's demographic. I thought that were him, that were a midget man. What's he called? Um, Warwick Davis. Yeah. <laughs> I, got, I got confused. Oh, look. There's more Dad's Army there. Hancock's Half Hour. Oh, is that not... That person we saw that he likes his humour, doesn't he? He does. Obviously. I'm sure we saw something about him somewhere else. He did. Well, it, a picture of something. Yeah. Somewhere. And what's what's that? Yeah, more BBC sort of comedy stuff. No messing around. What? Kenneth Williams. Oh. Um, That's uh, Carry On, isn't it? Yeah. I have seen some of the Carry On films when I was younger, but I don't really know much I about them. I used to watch them all the time with Babs Windsor. Yeah, she's dead. <laughs> He's dead. Yeah, they're all dead. Did he... What did he die of? Did he kill himself? I don't know. Oh, I feel, did he not kill himself because at the time it wasn't all right to be gay and he was gay and he was confused? I seem to remember that. I don't know. I don't know. You know more about that than me. I don't know whether it's right or not. I feel like I watched a documentary yeah, about it or something. Because that other one, weren't there? That With other glasses, one. glasses, all a bit camp. A bit camp. Um... I don't know. A person with glasses is the one. The only one I can think is that uh, when it Benny Hill. Oh, Benny Hill. He yeah. had little glasses, didn't he? Yeah, but that was <laughs> guy. That's, can't think what call that's it. just made me feel ill watching you do that. Uh, but... What? Some people I know oh, who his character were. He had little glasses. I don't know. Please don't do that with your tongue ever again, though. Right, let's go up this way and see what we can find. Oh. Well, half of them say, please do that with your tongue again. Oh, you tramp. Tracy. Don't, because Tracy's the one that's been going on about my teeth. Hello. And I was saying, what did I say? I said, yeah, because she wanted to come with us to Morocco. I said, yeah, that we took it back seats out. We could put you in ashtray, but we didn't really want her to come. And then she said, oh, well, what other thing? She's lactose intolerant. And I said, it's a made up disease. It's not real. <laughs> That's all the comment. <laughs> so she's going to come and fart through my letterbox, apparently. I know, it's a bit weird. Well, it's behind her, but it's not chair. <laughs> Why is that there? It's an odd place for a, like, tool chest. Yeah, I thought it was snap-on. If it was snap-on, it would be worse a bit. Oh, yeah. I don't mean a strap-on, I mean a snap-on tool kit. <laughs> no, look at this. Have you noticed anything about that? That what looks like a quite boring piece of furniture? No. Anything that stands out? On it lock? Yeah, look next to the lock. Oh, the date? 
Yeah, 1645. Oh, is that true though? I can't, why would it say 1645 if it weren't 1645? Some people just make things up. Yeah, but you're not going to fake it from 1645. What are you looking behind me for? I'm not again? looking at you, directly at you. You didn't, you looked there, out of that window. And then you, stop it. Right, when I went to Coco Chanel's and did the live, they're all saying someone were behind me. Don't you start as well. Although I keep seeing my torch in there as well now. <laughs> it's freaking me out. <laughs> I wonder if it is. I don't know. I don't know if I believe it or not now you've said it. But it just seems strange. What you? I thought you were lighting fires. You are. Stop I it. I am a fire starter, the mighty fire starter. <laughs> Stop it. That's encouraging bad behaviour in abandoned buildings. And you've seen what happens when people mess about with fires in abandoned buildings. Yeah. They go woof. No, dogs go woof. <laughs> Cats go meow. Oh God, don't start singing. What woof, does the woof. fox say? Get upstairs. That's what the fox say. Ding, 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 ding. Get up here. Whatever it is, I don't know what it is. What's this? I don't know, what's this? What is the punch? Punch. Well, where's Judy then? <laughs> I don't know what is punch. Is that next to Richard? Shut up. You do talk some absolute shit. January to June 1911. 1911? Oh, look. Punch of London. I can't even read what that says. Char. Mm -hmm. Cherry Vary. Cherry Vary? No, no clue. I'll go down and have a look. What? Yeah, January 11th, 1911. Keep going. Hey, January the 11th, 1911? Oh, no, it were. 1911 in November, weren't it? You heard that, didn't you? Yeah, that's, that's dodgy. What the fuck? It's not like a door closing. Yeah, no. Is that you? No. no it sounds like it's right behind you. And then there were a door over there. Yeah. Oh, look at that fucking spy. It's massive. That one there. There's noises coming. Nice. The door was blowing. There's no wind. There's zero wind. I've got fucking cobwebs in my hair. Right, there's a noise from there, and there's a noise from right next to his ear. I would have, I would have expected it to be you going. That way it went moving. I know. It's like fucking footsteps. It's not stopping though either. It's one of the rats with fucking boots on. Our roof is working later. <laughs> but then why does it keep doing that down there? This is fucking freaking me out. Jesus. Bloody hell. Oh, look at the drum. Big drum there. I'm so on edge. It's not even funny how much I'm on edge. Yeah, that's yeah. Same. Oh, look. Meccano. Meccano's so collectible, isn't it? Yeah. Go and have a look, see if it's in here. Is that a fold down bag? What the f in fact, where the fuck is it? It's not a fold down bag at all. 
Oh yeah, it's still there, look. I bet you full set. Yeah. Even with the Meccano proper screwdriver yeah. and everything. Yeah, look at that bike. Power trike? What? Somebody's got three wheels. Yeah, what's that? What with the end of it there, though? I don't understand that at all. Yeah. What else we got in here? Um, exercise bike. What's in this? What, killers? Killers? What is it? Keys. Oh, keys, lots of little keys. They're good. So they're quite old keys, those as well. Yeah. Like what? On wardrobe keys. Yeah. But that's a quite a modern, mm. well, 70s. Mm. It's like, you can just go and do fuck off. What the fuck? What the fuck is with all these noise? Oh, look at that. That's good, isn't it? See your face in mirror. As long as it seems to be else's <gasps> face. Oh, fucking, I've got to talk to him now. Quick, 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 quick. <laughs> Literally, <laughs> give me the chipping willies. Thing is, there's just so much little bits of stuff, like the swing era, the music of the th of 37 and 38, Vintage years of humour. Is what are you doing? You know you like compo. That's who you remind me of with that on. <laughs> Definitely. Definitely. I've seen these drawing things down here though. There's absolutely loads of like technical. Right. How do you do that that fast? <laughs> it's been impressive, yeah. You all have seen it six, sixty times. <laughs> no, but honestly, look at these. They're like. What would he use them for? I don't know what that one is. I know what they are. They're like little compasses, aren't they? Come yeah. pie. Are they come pie? Come pie, yeah, come pie. my lord. Come. The come pie sounds a bit dodgy, doesn't it? Like a soggy biscuit. Oh, God. Please tell me you've never played that game. I'm not like you, you dirty pig. I've never played it. I want to watch some here. No, it's an empty box. I looked in it already. Oh, yeah. I wanted to look what were in that black thing. That's why I bleeding opened it. Bleeding? What, what happens with that? It's like, is it technical drawing stuff? It's so much over that sort of stuff. But I don't it? know how it works. Well, now what's that? Is that a rubber? What? These what? are... That's got lead on it. Oh, yeah, like the nibby bit. Yeah. And then they attach somehow they attach to, to the somehow poles. I don't really get it. Same with these as well. like draftsmen. This one, no, this one's... What does it say on here? A and G Thornton. Tech set, tech set series. MOW number one two five one six. I don't really understand. <laughs> That's like sixties or something, isn't it? That. Three and sixties, aren't we? Look at that. Wow! Look at the state of you. All right, looking on here. You were a bit active, this guy. Look, he did his swimming long distance award. Personal survival, amateur swimming. He did the Duke of Edinburgh Award. Oh, does it say, what's it saying there? Is it all things he's achieved? Oh, is there an address on there? Yeah. I'll zoom out of that in a minute then. Um, what's he doing? What are the things he's done? Nothing, nothing. Has he done anything? Has he even started it? Oh yeah, first aid. Is that ambulance, it? Ambulance. So he's, what year is it? 1982? I'm sure it's... You're out of school. I'm sure it wasn't from 1965. I'm sure I just saw that on it. Yeah, just, I'll have to look away while you look. That's, that's his date of birth. Oh, he was born in 1965. Oh, so he's yeah. almost the same age as you. Yes. is. When is he older? A bit older than older, you. Yeah. Oh, look. That's all he did. Mini Skittles, like desk Skittles, that, isn't it? We got bored. You had a big stick there with a thing on, didn't you? And then you used to swing it round. Yeah, and knock them over. So, but yeah, he does look like he does stuff. And what's this? Certify that Paul Bennett has a senior grade examined in verse speaking. What is verse speaking? Just a posh speaker. They can go and do speeches. Oh, right. So it's like for yeah. events and things like that. Yeah. Right, I get you. What's in there? Well, in this one, some hubcaps. Well, wheel trims. Hubcaps. 
Why would you say wheel trims? Yeah. They're up caps. That's the old pensioners thing, that old caps. And then we've got thing. wipers in there. What? Right, wiper I can't blades. see it because you haven't shown me. Oh, wiper blades, yeah. Wiper blades. Are you sure that's what you call them? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Wipey, wipey, wishy washes. <laughs> and that one, it's got an headrest. And some more up caps. Some up caps. And. What? Yeah. The vents. Oh, is it the speakers? Yeah. Is his engine in this one? Might be in cupboard. Let's have a look. Oh, no, some Bisto. What's that at top? That box in middle at top? That box at top? Top, middle or bottom? What is it? Is it a razor? Thank you. Remington, yeah, yeah. Is that something to do with a car there? That see it thing? See it? No, not that. That ain't more. Oh, that is see it there. Somewhere. That's a thermostat. What? What? Don't you have them in a kettle or something? Why do you have a thermostat in a car? And then you've got a... That's something for a plant pot. Coil. A co right, how is that a coil? It's a coil. Coil uh, cap. Distributor cap. What does it do? In the old cars, right. you've got four um, cylinders. So right. there are four leads to go to your spark plug. So it's spark plug leads. That's where the main one goes in. That's... So, the so there were five then? Yeah, but there's only four cylinders. Right. So there used to be a rotor under here, where uh -huh. it used to spin round. And every time it touched one of those, it sent a spark or something to your engine to spark the spark plug. Does the spark plug not spark itself? No, it needs batteries. Why would you call a spark plug a spark plug if it doesn't even spark? No, because it needs electricity to make it spark. Oh, it's just all... This is why I don't do cars. Cars are stupid. And in a, in a traditional old combustion engine it used to fire on 1342. So first cylinder, third cylinder, fourth cylinder, second cylinder. Why would it not go in order? Because if it did it used to buckle the crankshaft. Oh my god, just shut up about cars. In fact just look in there. Oh no, I've looked in there. Have I looked in here? Oh my god Andy, you've missed this. How have you missed that? What? That plastic bag. What's in it? Nothing. You, be a fucking body bag. <laughs> god, oh my god, I'm going to just get your head in that. <laughs> oh my god. Be sure to subscribe and press that bell icon for all the latest updates. It's a shame it's broken, isn't it? Cheers. That's why have those people got three tits? <laughs> it's a beard. Oh, is it? Yeah, supposed to be a beard. A little like boobs and pig. What I call it? Pig. Oh, Piglet. piglet hanging by his ass. What's that? Is it just a display thing? Yeah. I thought it was like an award or something like that. I like this, you know. This orange, bright orange clock. Don't you think that's good? That's got an auction number on it. Is it? For leak. But yeah, that's, I like that clock a lot. I would, if that weren't so mucky, I'd have that myself. Oh, oh that's, that that's good. I don't no, know. electric. Is it? Not old? No. What's the thing next to the dinosaur? This? Yeah. It's a twin supply power unit. Yeah. What for? I don't get it. Anyway, I'm gonna have a look over here while you're faffing, looking at creams for boils. What have we got in here? Oh, a little, a little green bow tie set. Hey, wait a minute. Isn't this where the noise would have been coming from? Don't In this room. Because it's next to the stairs, isn't it? What is this? What is a 
RC1 rectify controller. What control? I don't. It, I don't know. I don't know what that would be for. Here, look. The thing that's like it's off a Dalek in there. I don't know. Oh, look, look, look. That's like a turntable from a. Yeah, it is. For a train or something. Yeah, I don't know. I reckon that's probably something to do with the, the train set, don't oh, yeah. you? Speed it up, slow it down. Yeah. Yeah, definitely. Yeah. Oh, no. Oh, look. Your favourite over here, Andy. Yeah, big pink stiff one. It's your sort of thing, isn't it? Yeah. Oh, Meccano. You know what? Meccano's worth fortune as well. Oh, this isn't quite as complete, but I think it's an old one, isn't it's it? Old one. It looks like one of the original types, and it's still in the um, polystyrene. What do Americans call it? It's not polystyrene in America, is it? Oh, who knows what they call stuff. I don't, it's, what is it? I feel like I should know it and I can't think what it is. Is it poly, polyurethane or something? You're poly, I don't know. Oh, stick it up your urethra. <laughs> yeah, there's, there's all sorts. Anyway, I'm gonna have a bit of a look. Oh, all right, look at that clock. That's all right. Yeah, that is. I like that. Right, I've just found this under a pile of clothes and it says, Diploma certificate certify that Roland Bennett, so I'm guessing that's his dad, uh, was the, on the first day of November 1922 elected professional associate of Surveyors Institution. So will that be to do with those things downstairs? Yeah. Or wherever it were? In that the bedroom. Or the bedroom, yeah, with the, the drawing. professional drawing stuff. Yeah. So that would tie in with that. So I wonder if he did it as well as his dad. Possibly. They seem to be quite that sort of people, though, don't they? Like with the train sets, mm. with the uh, Meccano, and things like surveying and things like that. It all sort of ties in for me that you get a set sort of person that's into stuff. Yeah, and there's screwdrivers everywhere, I've, like, and bits of all sorts, isn't there? Yeah, um, like chisels and stuff as well. Like they make stuff and do stuff with the hands yeah, quite a lot. Like clamp set there a lot as well yeah i noticed that 12 piece clamp set is there anything on the windowsill because i know there was in other the other rooms oh yeah more chisels so yeah you definitely were into all sorts of things like that definitely what the hell is in that box behind you i think i know what it is how many is there in there? 102. 102? Clean herself for healthcare. How? How much of a bladder problem has he had? No, but saying that, the single use though, surely. Yeah, because they're lying on that paper, aren't yeah. they? Yeah, so that's like what? Maybe a couple of months worth? How many pisses do you have? Fucking loads, mate. Well, yeah, you're I'm old. You're old though. Um, I think Four I probably. Four a day? Five a day? Oh, no, I probably have two or three. A day. Depends how much I drink, to be fair. Mm, yeah. But either way... Four a day is well, 25 days. Even if it's two, it's 50. Yeah. So, yeah, a couple of months. One or two months, isn't it? The snake would have come out of here. God. Dread to think. You know, just some plastic bags. Right. Keep moving. Next. Right. I've just heard a massive bang around the front of the house. We've had to come round the back and slip out this way. I've just done this and I don't know if you'll... Bloody hell, Andy. Could it be any louder? Jesus Christ, man. Guessing we can't go that way. So we've sort of pulled his pants a little bit, trying to get around here because we've pretty much done anything anyway. But I've just... Shut up, man. Jesus Christ. Every time I try and show him over there, Can you see that in the distance, Andy? Have you got a pointy torch with you? You can see him all there, look. Yeah. Mm. Look. All the eyes looking back at us. Loads of eyes. <laughs> it's sheep. There's loads of sheep, but it for a split second I just went, ah, what is that? Anyway, I'm going back this way again now. I don't know if we can get through that door at the end, you know. Right, so we can't. That is absolutely rusted shut. 
There's no way out this way. We're gonna have to go the front way. If there's somebody around there, I don't know what we're gonna do. No. Like this way I thought was our, our banker of getting out of here before we got caught. What is he now? We need to just shift quickly. Right, I think we've managed to get to somewhere we can get out. Everything's been really noisy. There's a light on up there, Andy. I swear that weren't on a minute ago when we came up. So I think we were at the other side of the house, which is there. That definitely wasn't on. There's been motion sensor on as well, that one, won't it? Oh yeah. No, but the thing is, the drive runs behind there because that's the back of the other side of the house. Yeah, because we walked up. This so we would have seen that. That would have been really bright down that drive. It's gone off. What? It's gone off. What the fuck? What do we do? Try and walk up quietly. Yeah, good idea. Try not to go that way. idea where we were he's gone he's been gone a bit we've been crouching down for about 10 15 minutes <laughs> my ankles are killing but yeah look this is where we were in here now he walked down you will have seen him walk down here and he shone his torch up through this window didn't he yeah what is that oh it's a fire extinguisher is it an old style one? yeah that's weird yeah, yeah, I was like resting up against this, not knowing what I'm about to kick over. And you know what? If we had walked around the other side, I reckon we would have knocked all sorts of stuff over. I couldn't move over because the glass. Yeah. What is this? Is it a big Fiat? A bit big for a Fiat, isn't it? This. What? I don't know. 
Lift it up. That's gorgeous. Is it? Oh, it's not a Fiat. Oh, it's a Rover. It's a Rover. It's still got exhaust. What did you expect it not to have? It's still got exhaust. Oh. Yeah. Looks really clean and new. For good news. Yes. Come on. I'll have to have a look at the inside. I'm scared he's going to come back though. That's the problem. Yeah, it looks in quite good condition. It's very clean and shiny, isn't it? Oh. Got seat covers on. Yeah. Can't get it to focus. Bit best colour as well. Yeah. British racing green. It's brand spanking. Well, it's not brand spanking new, but it looks in really good condition. Ah, uh, what? Average. Ah, well, W is two thousand, I think, or ninety nine. So say W is two thousand. Two ninety five, ninety six. Yeah, something like that. Something like that. That's 27 years old. Right, we need to get out of here because he could quite easily be going to get more people or whatever, or his dog. So we just need to shift quick, really. Right. See you back at car. Right, that was an interesting escape. For a change though, we didn't get chased with men with sticks and stuff. We just managed to get away, didn't we? Yeah, like, stealthily this time. Yeah, old age ninjas are back. But something I need to ask everybody to do, if you watch our videos and you enjoy them and you're not subscribed, can I please ask you to do it? Because I don't know what's happened recently. It's just gone like, mm. like people are watching every week. There's tens of thousands of people watching every week, but not everybody's subscribed, so please do it. Yeah. If you don't do it for me, do it for him. Do it for me, please. Yeah. It... I'm bored at work. <laughs> exactly. Anyway, it was quite an exciting little explore. It wasn't as good as I expected it to be. I no. thought there was going to be some more bits, but I think there's been some stuff pinched out of there, which, oh, is, so. which is a shame. But yeah, I do like seeing stuff. I like games and things as well. Do you know what I mean? Like seeing old stuff like Meccano and, and things. Mm. Did you play with Meccano as a kid? Yes. I didn't. I did. I was never... I didn't have a lot of it, but yeah, I did. I, I didn't really get past stickle bricks, me. More Lego than uh, Meccano. I liked Lego, but I had a habit of like shoving it places I shouldn't. How many pieces of Lego could you shove up your bum, do you think? Well, knowing yours, full set. <laughs> is there such thing as a full set? Yeah, well, could... it, it's Lego built into a into Big Ben, and that shoved up your bum. <laughs> or, um, what's that? Starship Enterprise or something like yeah. that. Going sideways. Anyway. Going where no man has ever been before. Not yet. <laughs> Thank God. <laughs> right. <laughs> right. And on that... We are going, so we will see you soon. And it's only, like, what, three and a half weeks now till we go to Morocco? Like by the time this comes out, it's three less three than weeks. three weeks. Nervous. Right. Yes, I'm nervous. Excited, nervous, and scared. All at the same time. Yes. Right. Love you all. Oh, there's a car just coming, so we better go. Yeah. See you later. Bye-bye.